YouTube Nation. It's for your success. Dr. Brandon Four. Welcome to the Trinity Alps, Northern California. We are at the Canyon Creek Trailhead, right here. And we're gonna be hiking to some beautiful Alpine lakes today. It could be a long hike today just to get to the lakes eight miles one way, and it is an out and back. Hi YouTube, thanks for coming along today. I'm in Trinity National Forest, off to see some beautiful alpine lakes today. We're about an hour and a half from Redding, California, and about a hundred miles to the coast. So situated is mountains that really only go up to eight or 9,000 feet. But the pictures of this hike made me say, I want to check this one out and share it with you. I'm really looking forward to seeing what the views are of this beautiful area. Hard to read that old sign, but we've reached the 6.1 mile intersection. We're off to Canyon Creek Lakes. So we have a few miles to go. Looking forward to seeing them. Here with California in such a drought, that's a pretty good waterfall. Lots of old growth in here. Maple, Ponderosa, and even some redwood. In case you're wondering, this is all granite.
just beautiful up here. Oh, and there's the lake. Wow, it is just beautiful up here. Spiring cliffs of granite all around you. This incredible alpine lake. It's late October and the temps are in the upper 50s. Perfect weather to be up here this time of year. Even with as much drought as California's had, the waterfalls are still running. Granted, I know it's nothing compared to what they normally would be, but even with that, still a beautiful and amazing experience to be up here today. That sure was one beautiful alpine lake. But why go to one? When you can see two. at this lake against the giant granite cliff walls. Just beautiful up here. Oh my goodness. Now this is an absolute amazing panorama 360 degree view of both lakes where I'm standing. Now you might be wondering, what are they studying out here with a camera? Great news. That is a beaver dam. Why is it so special? Because it's the first beaver to be in this area in over a hundred years. Beavers haven't been in this area for a long time. And this year, a beaver started building a dam here and there are signs all over the place requesting people to not disturb the beaver dam. It's wonderful to see important wildlife returning to where it's once been. Currently doing some fun exploring up here. I'm off trail, but that's no worry. It's easy to find the trail. It was created by the CCC back in the Great Depression, the Civilian Conservation Corps, the 1930s, which tells you that has been there a long time. breeze is picked up. This is the lower lake. Just a gorgeous day. More people starting to come up now. A lot of campers. But I'm heading back to the valley. What an incredible place to hike. 
I'm really enjoying my experience up here. A little windy, but can't ask for much better weather in late October. I don't know about you, but that might be the most amount of roots I've ever seen. You know what? Somebody worked really hard on making that Karen. And the route cuts over here, all the way back down. All done, back at the car, 17 miles round trip. What a amazing hike, the Trinity Alps. It's hard to find, but once you get there, a great jewel to discover. I'm for your success, Dr. Brandon Four. Hey, thanks for watching. Give me the thumbs up, share it with your friends and family. I got hikes all over this great country and continuing to always find new ones because as a doctor, that's what research is all about. Till next time, get out to nature, take care.